Egg Yields National Database. Homepage and Dashboard. Welcome to Egg Yields National Database website. At the top right side of the screen there are three menu options. Dashboard, Help Guide and User Profile. Select the Dashboard option and wait to move to the Dashboard page. You will be able to see all the submitted datasets submitted by you and other users and all the draft datasets you have created. You will not be able to view other people's draft datasets. At the top of the All Datasets list, there are two main search options, Region and Species. By clicking on the grey arrow to the right of each box, a drop-down list appears. If Region is a search option, the system looks for datasets containing sites in the selected regions. If Species is a search option, the system looks for sites and experiments that have the selected species, either as a dominant species or an additional mixed species. If you have both region and species selected, the system looks for studies that match both the criteria. Let's say we want datasets which contain yield or flowering records in Southland and Otago as the regions, with ripe clover and red clover as the species. From the region list, Click on Otago and Southland. Click somewhere outside the box to keep your selection. Now select from the species list. The species list is alphabetically ordered but it is long, so you may prefer to start typing in the search box to speed up the search process. Use the grey bar at the right side of the drop box list to help find the species. Click the search icon on the right side of the screen. The system will return to a superset of all studies containing white clover and red clover in both regions. The search results are shown below the region search box. Click on clear search criteria to make a new search. Let's go back to our white clover and red clover search example. To change or remove one of the species, just hover over the search box and untick the box with white clover, for example. Click the search icon at the right side of the screen to redefine the search. To bring white clover back again, use the same process and remember to click the search icon. You can right click on a study title and choose to open the dataset in another tab or window. That way you can have the search results open in one tab or window and look at the datasets in a separate tab or window. The last column on the left side of the screen allows the download of the dataset as a CSV file. The CSV format can easily be opened in Excel to manipulate the data further. Click on the download icon and wait a few seconds. The system automatically saves the file onto your computer. Check the download folder, locate the file and double click to open it in Excel.